Good morning guys, it's beautiful day in Leyte as always. So now for today's video, we'll, we'll, we will be cooking sinigang and I'm going to go to Burgos today since today is market day and also um, market day is where you can we, you can buy a lot of different different types of vegetables in the market and different the, um, there's a lot of fresh meat too the, um, there's a lot of fish and shrimp and crabs you just need to go there early and you can get a lot of supply every the market day is here is every Tuesday Wednesday no yeah Wednesday and Saturday, Saturday. so now we're I'm going to go to Burgos and see you there the sea is very nice oh yes today it's, is beautiful day it's oh, sunny yeah and it's not that windy it's so hot though that we will be needed this this is called kangkong i don't know what you call it in english so i'm going to ask my cousin to research about this and put it on the screen while editing the video and we have here um i'm not sure what you call this in english too we call this what do you call it again karlang yeah karlang we call it karlang and we have here tomato gar i mean onion and Ceiling is fada. This is a long chili. And we have here okra, eggplant, and long beans, and uh, onion. Leaves. <laughs> ah, what do you call it, ma? What's it called, ma? Sibuyas dahon. Sibuyas dahon, yes. And of course, a kilo of beet. So, in case you guys are wondering what is sinigang, sinigang is a it's really famous in the Philippines. It's it's a sour soup with a lot of vegetable with different types of vegetable in it and and just recently Sinigang has been recognized as 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 one of the most as one of the best rated Yeah, best rated vegetable best rated soup. vegetable soup in the world. That is according to Sin in Philippines. Yeah. Yes, so now we're let's get started. Prepared. We're now going to slice it. Okay. Ma, unsa ra I'm asking my mom because I'm not really quite sure. This is my first time to cook sinigang. Ingana? Sure? Oh, that way. Okay. Oh. Okay. Okay. That way. Bye. Oi. So you learned a lot cooking from your mom, right, Chrissy? Yes, I was watching when I, when growing up, I was watching my mom cooking since she always told me to always watch her when 
every time she's cooking. So it, it is safe to say that cooking was influenced by your mom. You are influenced by cooking by your mom. Yes, I can say that. My mom is a good cook. I love her cooking. She's a good cook, of course. Every time, it's so funny, guys, because every time I go to restaurants, I always, I always compare their food to my mom's food. Like I always, I always say, oh, my mom's food is is better than this. So for you, the standard of cooking is the cook of your mom. <laughs> yes, <laughs> I think everyone can relate to me, especially if you're a Filipino. Yeah. May ngani ma? Ang ang katasun ma? Ana? Katasun si kaman? Ana? Since I told you, it's my first time to cook sinigang. But for me, sinigang is very delicious. Of course, it is. I this is Hannah's favorite this soup. This is one of my favorite. I'm not really. I mean, is this I your favorite, Hannah? Yes. I oh, love yes. sinigang, and this is Hannah's favorite soup. And Tim, this is not Tim's favorite, but did <laughs> Tim already yeah. taste it? Yeah, of course, but he does eat. May nga na kurma mga kukurama ka doon unra. Yes, eh, pareha siya pong sa taong pero idag ko. Ito nga na. So you're learning from your mom, Chrissy. Okay. Kana? Okay. Oh my god. My mom is saving my day. Aksidili yung dalawin. You know, when my mom was growing up, this is what they always eat, right, mama? This is what they always eat. It is a. I'm not sure, guys. I'm going to put the name in, the in English. Yeah, in English. Carlang. Yeah, we call it Carlang. Instead of rice, they eat Carlang. My mom too also ate that when growing up. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, this is healthier. But I. I don't really like. I, I do eat this, but I prefer sweet potato than this. I love sweet potato. May mo po ning pot nga ang ha? No. O gusto kag hang. I was asking my mom if I'm going to slice the chili but she said no, it's going to be really spicy. spicy. If you like it spicy, then slice it. <laughs> then if not, then no. You're not gonna... Wait, I see. Ah, okay. Someone, someone commented um, in your previous video, Chrissy, to uh, to use apron. Oh yes, I don't have apron. Is it really necessary? It's fine if I'm going to get my clothes dirty. <laughs> I mean, yeah, sure, they guys. Just suggested it. Yeah, sure. I'm going to buy an apron. Thank you for suggesting that. I was really not thinking about apron. But yes, I will buy one. Once I go to Masin or Burgos, maybe I can find one there. I don't know if you have this in your country, guys. What do you call this in your oh, country? Oh, this is my favorite. It's kangkong in the Philippines. Yeah, kangkong. And there's also the other one, Joseph. You call it... Ganas. Yeah, ganas. It's, but this it's is the my sweet favorite. potato leaves. Yes. Sweet potato leaves. I love that one compared to ganas. And I think your tomatoes doesn't look like this. Yeah, their tomato looks more healthier, more bigger. Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, it's bigger. It's bigger. May nga na yun si Jama. May nga na, atas on. May nga na. Oh, yes. Sakto, mother? Okay, so I'm right. And suppose we, we're gonna buy a pork belly. Pork belly. But, but yes. unfortunately, we have no They're out of it. We have so, no pork belly. So, this is okay. We're finished um, slicing all the ingredients. This is how you're going to slice the the meat. Actually, it's up to you on how we have different of references on cutting the, the the ingredients. It's up to you how you're going to slice it. But the proper way of slicing a it is sinigang is as big as this one. And first, we're now boiling water. And then once it's boiled, we're going to put the one kilo of one kilo of pork. And then after that, we have this the root crops. It is called carlang. We're going to put it together with the pork until tender. Yes, until boil until tender. tender. Yeah. Okay, now we're just waiting for it. We're boiling now the water. 
the water is already boiling so now we're going to put all the I mean we're going to put the pork the the ginger the and the, root the, the root crop we forgot to mention about the ginger earlier. earlier yeah because we my if they didn't remind me then I I wouldn't know that you also need to put ginger so now we're going to put the the pork the ginger and the root crop <laughs> oh my god, sorry Joseph, sorry! It's okay. Sakit, Seth? Not that much. <laughs> sorry. I... Put the pork until tender. Yes. <clears throat> Can you explain about this, Christy, why we need to put this? The sinigang mix? Oh yes, it is for... Because this is... Oh, it is supposed to be tamarind. Yeah, tamarind, be, but... We couldn't find any tamarind, so we're using sinigang mix. It is sour. It will be make the it, soup make sour. The soup sour yeah. But there are some alternatives to tamarind. Like we'll just put it and flush oh, it that, here. Yes. The alternatives. Well, they can do it, you. Good. Then wait, wait until the pork gets tender. Then what's next? To we're put going here. to put all this next when the pork is tender right yeah and then after this and this will be the last the last one yeah okay so we'll just wait till <clears throat> this will boil and be tender right chrissy yes so we'll be back once it boils it's already tender guys and now we're going to put a salt for this and also we're going to put the the onion and the tomato <laughs> sorry sip the water always spills on me sorry. i think the water hates you no the water knows that i am hydrophilic or i love water <laughs> so you're I putting the sinigang yeah. mix now i already put the sinigang mix don't put too much because it's going to be really sour. Yeah. But if sinigang mix is not available in your country, you can put tamarind like like this or tamarind. Or it is called sampalok in our place. After a while, we're going to put this. Yes, the we're egg going plant. to put the eggplant. Sorry guys, I'm not really oh, master. Really Just only one mother? Oh my god. Chili. We're also going to put the chili. And the eggplant. Yes. I will. This is too much vegetables. <laughs> That's why it's called vegetable ah. soup. Of course, Mother Earth. I'm going to try to taste if it's already sour. Or if we need to put more sinigang mix. Is it delicious? It is, but the, Joseph, I forgot. I only, you need to put more because it's not sour. Yeah, you need more. It depends on how how your sour sour tolerance is. Yes, because there are really a lot. Uh, there are people that love sour. Me, it's, me. I just I love want sour. it. Really, I just yeah. want it to be like just normal. I mean, not too much sour. And we will wait till, until the eggplant is tender. <laughs> Yeah, we need to put more. It's not sour. More magibitay sa gawas ma. Ako kuan. Mmm, that's that looks delicious. Of course. We'll just wait for it, okay? And we'll be back once it's ready. Now we're going to put the remaining ingredients. Not the remaining because the kangkong is still there. Oh yes, I mean the we're going to put the long beans, the okra and the onion leaves. I'm the 
Bati ko gati ng English tim sip timoy. Wow, a lot of vegetables. Sip kan yut kuan. The higher the the. Oh, it's delicious. Yeah, natin. Ang kasi sip ido man ang sip. Ah, ido man. Okay, sige. Snower for the Of course. Ma, it's overflowing, mother. Because there's a lot of, I think, vegetables. We use a smaller pot. Yeah, we should have used the bigger one. We don't have the bigger one. So we don't have any choice. Just wait for it till it get. It get cook. And the, and then it's ready to eat, right? Yes. We'll just wait for it. Oh, so it will be just... back once it's ready to eat. It's now cooked, so I'm going to try to read this. I'm going to be biased, but I'm going to see if the, this looks it's going super to delicious. Taste good. You, the viewers, if you were to rate this by the looks, how would you rate it or how much would you rate it? Comment down. Yeah, I'm going to rate it 100 again. 110. I can rate it too. I can try it. Yes, juicy. it. Sige, sip. Okay. But I... Juicy, we're going to rate it too. Yeah, I'm gonna taste it. You read, uh, you taste it first. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna use this. Oh, it's just exactly how I wanted it to taste like. It's good. Me, yeah, I'll try it. I'll try it. Mm. Since this is my favorite, and I would rate it uh, an 8 out of 10. Okay, I'm going to rate it 100. <laughs> out of 10. Actually, the thing that I like about about Sinigang is the fat. I love the fat so much. It's really good. Oh, this looks super delicious. So now we're going to eat. And this is not yummy without rice. Yeah, of course, we can't eat without rice. So. Filipino loves rice so much. So guys, okay. we're now going to eat and I'll just get back to you. Yeah, we'll just get back to you. Yeah, we'll just get back to you. Yeah, we'll just get back to you. Say hi. Say hi. Hello. Say hi to the camera. Hello. Dale. Dale. Say hi. We're looking. Guys, we're just done cooking and we already tasted it. My mom already went home to get... And she already... I gave her some of the some of the sinigang since it was a lot for us and she went home already and I'm thankful for my mom because she helped me cook it. This is really my first time cooking sinigang. So I already have an idea if I'm going to cook it again next time so I will not have any problem again. So, say hi Dale. Say hello. Hello. Ha um, Hannah just finished giving Dale a bath and Dill is fresh right now, right? Say hi, hello, bye. Say bye, bye. No bye, bye. She's shy, bye. like Tita Hannah. She's shy. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching this vlog till the very end. Just tell me what kind of food you want me to try next time. You you would want me to try to cook next time. I will. I will see if I can be able to to cook it. If not, then I can just easily. Search it in YouTube. For sure, there will be a lot of instruction. Anyway, thank you for watching this video, and please don't forget to like and subscribe. And always remember that you are you are responsible for your act for for every action that you make. <laughs> Say bye, Dil. Bye. No bye bye. So guys, take care and God bless. Bye bye.